Welcome back to Ebru Africa this morning with me, Charity Shkene, only on On Trend. Well, this being a whist. Easter weekend, we're having a lot of people just gearing themselves towards this particular holiday. And a majority of the tweets coming in on our trending topics here in Kenya are just on a light mode on exactly just setting that mood for the Easter season. So let's begin with one of the hashtags making its way across this particular Easter season. We have who's the best Kenyan DJ. And one thing I should take you through is the pronounce is, is the spelling of the word who's. Now, that is not the proper spelling of who's. It's supposed to be w-h-o hive uh apostrophe then s so kenyans indeed are not taking that lightly and they are asking we want the registrar who says i cannot believe who's the best kenyan dj is trending with its poor grammar should be w-h-o then apostrophe then the letter s so indeed kenyans are indeed making a lot of buzz in this particular hashtag but apart from the grammar mistakes that it it has basically in the first word there we're having a lot of kenyans just giving in their best dj and the person who's taking home the trophy today um hopefully before the end of the day it might change but for now the person who's taking the most credits for being the best dj here in the kenya here in kenya is a dj mufalme so indeed congratulations to dj mufalme for now as we await to see how that particular uh, poll comes to an end now moving on swiftly we have here um <clears throat> one particular uh, hashtag that i should highlight for you now what's the worst football team that's another hashtag trending and in this particular uh, hashtag we're having a lot of people bashing the arsenal team the, but though they're putting it in a very uh comical and very hidden kind of rhetorical kind of questions indeed it still proves that uh, arsenal is taking the heat but they are not taking it lightly they're not taking it uh, backs down they are responding with the hashtag come on you gunners but indeed have a look at this uh, what's the worst football team and you can have your pick all teams have been bashed. Others are saying Chelsea is the best team. Every other team, after, uh, any other team other than Chelsea is not a good team. Others are bashing David Moyes and the, um, the, the Manchester United team. So we have here Edward who says, what's the worst football team? Any team whose coach is a David Moyes. We have here uh, Bushido Brown who says, what's the worst football team? Any team with a comedian as a coach like Asen Wenger. So do I say RIP grammar? And then we have here Jesse Osiep Osieps who says, I do not know what the worst football team is. All I know is Mourinho is the best coach. So congratulations to Mourinho there, a positive tweet. And then we have here Special Force who says, do I really know? Yep. I know Arsenal, Arsenal is the worst football team. So indeed, a lot of people here, uh, we have here Phillips, Etimessi, who says, what's the worst football team? Any team that isn't Chelsea. So indeed, this is quite a thorough thrashing of Arsenal. And but this particular whole world, we find a lot of people just bashing the Arsenal team, but they're not taking it uh, lying down. We have here, come on, you gunners. Let me open the streets that have just arrived at the moment. So there we have some of the photos coming in. Now, indeed, they're saying uh, that they're just giving a lot of love to their team. And they are, they're giving love and actually just championing the team to continue forward. Now, they are still in contention to the FA Cup. They are in, in good standings to win this particular cup. So, indeed, as much as they are in a losing streak when it comes to the Barclays Premiership 2013-2014 season, they have a lot to uh, still look forward to. We have here Oscar Salza who says, well done, team. Come on, you gunners. We have here Mulinda who says, uh, did not watch the Arsenal versus West Ham game, but just in the highlights, great goal by Giroud. Uh, and here, fast touch was brilliant. Come on, you gunners. So indeed, the gunners are 
coming up and are just supporting their team. So indeed, we're expecting to see a lot of this coming in. So one thing I could highlight is that, um, and this is my take on it, uh, when it comes to matches, Arsenal, their fans are loyal to their teammates. So even though there's a lot of bashing on the internet, there's always a positive spin that the fans are going to have in this particular say. So moving on to one last tweet that is making way is the hashtag the five series so if indeed you are wondering what you need to keep your eye for on the easter holidays what to keep you busy what series is to watch what movies it's to partake in this is a hashtag to follow people are giving their best five takes on series that have come thus far let's take a look at some we have here Nyambega Gisesa, who says, crisis, bad break, good wife, a suits, killer woman. These are just the five series you are currently watching. We have here Khan, who says, scandal, Game of Thrones, Blacklist, Big Bang Theory. The following are the big five series you are currently watching. So indeed, it is one very nice hashtag here. So if you have never heard of some of these series, you can go get your copy at your nearest distributor uh, and retailer of this particular um, this particular series and have you say this is a long period it's a long holiday of four days so you can get yourself entertained at this same time so indeed the hashtag to be at is the hashtag the five series i am charity up next is media watch with beryl or bye-bye